Well, an Instacart driver in Georgia is being credited with saving two lives. Yeah, it's all because she paid attention to her surroundings and followed her instincts. Channel 3's Nicole Nalepa has more in today's Bright Spot. I just want to start this off by saying, if you see something, say something. That's how Jessica Higgs started this TikTok, explaining an Instacart delivery she'll never forget. But it was far from where this story started. It started as an Instacart delivery, not unlike one she's done hundreds of times before. One ordered by a woman in Atlanta for her dad. This is for someone who can't shop, so let me get everything he can get. She went the extra mile for them. When she showed up at the home, she immediately noticed something just wasn't right. And he just was stumbling all over the place, and there was something different about that. The order asked Jessica to leave the groceries on the front porch, but this man clearly wasn't well. Instacart only recommends drivers enter customers' homes if they're invited and if they feel comfortable. Now, Jessica always followed that advice. But I used my judgment and I brought the groceries inside. That's when she smelled something. And it's a pretty predominant smell. That's when I realized the smell had to have been coming from the propane. There was a gas leak in the home. Jessica sent a message to his daughter telling her what she noticed. And she credited Jessica with saving her dad's life and increased her tip from $14 to 100 Thank you so much. Once my son went to check on my dad, it turned out it definitely was leaking. You definitely saved my dad and my younger son's life. <laughs> I was Instacarting that day a lot because I was short on rent. And that just meant the world to me. I'm a single parent, newly single parent with two kids. Um, and it's hard to find a job. Every job that I've applied to, they don't want to hire me because of my availability because I have kids. I'm just an Instacart worker, but if you see something, say something. And I did. And I'm so happy I did. With today's Bright Spot, I'm Nicole Nalepa.